Hey guys, I haven't seen you guys in a minute. So, <clears throat> I am now at my dad's house. No longer living with my mom. But, um, a week before I started living here, I ended up in the hospital. I had a really bad UTI. And they tried to teach me again to cast myself. And for whatever reason, I just can't get it. So, they put me on a temporary permanent solution kind of it's temporary because once either I have someone to physically cast me or I somehow learn on my own they will take out the catheter that I'm currently on I have a Foley catheter and I'm like full-time user now and until I get another person to cast me or I learn myself this is pretty much what I'm gonna have to be doing so Long story short, um, they put in the catheter, and the reason for that was because I, like I've told you guys in the past, I am incontinent, so I am very prone to UTIs. And in 2016, I was hospitalized with urosepsis, which just is a fancy word for I got sepsis due to a UTI that never got cleared up. And I have a neurogenic bladder, which means that my bladder never fully empties out. So their solution was to give me a Foley catheter so that I am constantly voiding my catheter to its full capacity so that no urine is actually staying in my in my bladder. And it like eliminates the chances, well not completely, but somehow eliminates the risk of um, having a UTI more often. And at first, like, don't get me wrong, like, I was, like, totally against it. But now that I have had it for about a week, I'm actually not, not to say that I love it, but I'm not totally against it anymore because um, it has made my life a little less stressful. I don't have to worry about UTIs anymore. And then on top of that, I'm not having accidents anymore because my thing is I can't feel when I have to urine so I was constantly having accidents because of it I haven't had an accident since I've had the catheter because obviously my urine goes into the catheter so I haven't had an accident because of it I'm still using pull-ups just because I am incontinent in both um, my urine and also my bowel movements but I'm not changing my pull-ups every two or three hours because of the fact that I have to because of urine anymore. Now, if I change it, it's just because um, I had an accident due to like my bowel movements or something like that, but no longer urine. So this is actually not a bad idea. So yeah, I am now a fully, um, full-time, fully catheter user. And also since I am allergic to um, latex, it's a silicone one so let me show you guys what it looks like and if you guys don't want to see urine just skip this part I'll come back to you guys after I show you guys what it looks like so this is pretty much it like I have it hanging right now on a computer desk but um, this obviously is the full on catheter that goes into um, my bladder. This is how I empty it out. And then it has this hook right here. And then also this like string that I can carry it around. And then um, I just have to empty it out every so often. I usually just empty it out once it gets heavy. But this is a long cord that just I can move around with it. Okay, so they did give me, sorry, it's a little blurry. Okay, there we go. So they did give me another bag that goes on my leg, but for the most part, I tried it for like just that first day and didn't like it because I have braces. So for me to walk around with the brace and then the bag on top of it, it just wasn't going to work because it would have to go into my brace and I was scared it was going to pop. So this is just an easier way to do it, just with the bigger bag. But um, the only downside that I've had to kind of figure out is showering because there is a bandage that goes onto my leg to keep the Foley catheter in place. And 
that's been the only challenge because it can't get wet. So I've had to figure out how I'm going to do that. I'm still trying to figure it out, but so far it's working. <laughs> so anyways, just wanted to give you guys a little life update. I am now full-time fully fully catheter user. It's weird to say full-time fully catheter user. Anyways, so yeah. Anyways, that's all I have for you guys for today. So as always, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. And I'll see you guys next time.